hi everyone welcome back to my channel this tutorial is on how to create a matted picture frame on photoshop open a picture by clicking on file and open and this is the picture which we will create a matte picture frame for first duplicate the picture layer which is currently the background layer by pressing ctrl and j then select background layer again click on image and canvas size change the white and height to what you like by experimenting with it in this instance i'm putting white 4 and height 4 ensure the relativity option is ticked i'll leave the canvas extension color as white and click ok you can see the size of the frame if you do not like the size you can undo by pressing ctrl and z and you can set another canvas size select the background layer and create a new layer and fill it with the color white by changing the foreground color to white and select the paint bucket tool then click now this layer has become white i'll now apply a stroke to this layer so click on the layer style icon at bottom stroke i want to keep the color black but i'll change the structure size and change the position to inside as you can see then click on bevel and emboss I'm changing the style to stroke emboss and selecting chisel hard as the technique. I'll also change the size and as you can see a nice shape has come to the frame. I'm changing the angle to 120 so the shape and angle change as shown. After that, I'm going to change the highlights opacity. You can experiment with all of these functions and set your own angles, opacity and size. I want to change the shadow mode to screen and color white and you can see what that has done. When I click OK, that is done. Now right click on layer 2, the layer we just worked on and click rasterize layer style. Select the magic wand tool. And make sure sample all layers is unticked as I am showing. I will make the background layer and layer 1 invisible. Then I will click with the magic wand tool. So the inside is selected and press backspace on your keyboard. It will delete the background. To deselect, click select menu and deselect. Now you can make the background and layer 1 visible again. Keep layer 2 selected and click on layer style icon and apply drop shadow. I want to change the opacity to around 60%. Keep the angle at 120. Keep the distance as it is, but I also want to change the size to 10 
and when I'm happy, I'll press OK. Create a new layer. Select the rectangular marquee tool and draw a rectangular around the picture as I am doing so. Ensure you do this nicely. Now get the paint bucket tool and fill in the select part with white. You can see the selected part of the new layer has been filled in white. Deselect by going on select and deselect or press ctrl and D on keyboard. Next I want to give this an inner glow effect. So click on layer style icon, inner glow and I'll change and play around with the settings of the inner glow. I'll change the blend mode to multiply and set the color to black. Change the size and press OK. You may change the layer opacity. I am decreasing it to 20%. And with that, I am finished and you can see that we have created a very nice and realistic matte picture frame when you are happy save it as a jpeg thank you so much for watching please like comment subscribe and share keep coming back for more tutorials see ya